Hey guys, so we are back in the Raccoon Police Department within today's episode. I'm actually not looking forward to this. I didn't really do too well with this police department back in Resident Evil 2. Not a really big fan of the long hallways, narrow hallways, bunch of doors, zombies coming out of nowhere. This is probably going to be really similar to the experience we had in Resident Evil 2. But of course, today we're going to be taking a look at our friend Carlos, the only man in the world that looks good with a mop for a head. Very handsome young fellow. So on the last episode, we had an encounter with yet again, of course, yours truly, Nemesis. The guy just doesn't freaking die. He came at us first with like just a weird slimy tentacle that comes out of his hand. And then last episode, he came at us with a flamethrower in which we battled him on top of a rooftop and we were like, yay, we killed him. No, we didn't. He actually came back after that with a flamethrower. And then, of course, Carlos was able to save us once again. Uh, we, we made it into the train station and we're like, yay, we're leaving out of Raccoon City. But then, of course, you know, things happen for a reason. And in this game, Carlos was not able to make it. Jill left in the train. And, of course, we found out that Nikolai is an asshole. He wants us dead. And he's pretty much set us up. He locked us in one of the trains and uh, he left us there to die when Nemesis was chasing us. Fortunately for Jill... Victor sacrificed his life for the C4 and blew up Nemesis, in which we thought he died again, but I don't think he's dead quite yet. So right now, we're pretty much at the point where we're playing with Carlos because he had to leave the train. He wasn't able to get on the train because they got orders to go rescue a doctor. And right now, it looks like we are in the Raccoon Police Department where Leon was in Resident Evil 2. So this shall be very interesting that we are about to relive some memories I really don't want to relive. But as always... My name is Hollow, and welcome back! Let's do this. Now, I think this is probably before Leon arrived at the Raccoon Police Department. And we've got some body bags. Yep. Nice decoratives, if you will. Yeah, this is actually exactly where we were with Leon. Brad, stop! T. Oh, not you too. Isn't that Martin? What was his name? The cop. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, dude, that's how he got bit. Oh, he probably like felt like, oh, there's probably still human in him. And he was like, ah, oh. he got bit. Yeah. Don't ever trust a zombie. Shit, it's locked. Oh, you stay God. on the door. I got this fucker. All right, Carlos, let's fucking go. Come get some. Come get some, bitch. Got an assault rifle full of lead. That's right, you little punk ass. Better stay down. Damn, he died rather quickly. All right, we got an ID card from Brad. Thank you, Brad, for the ID These card, stars. I'm sure. That could be useful. I'm Open. sure this is going to come in handy. All right, you actually give me a sec there, uh, pal. I'm going to go downstairs and investigate. Of course, the main objective here is not only to play the story, but in this playthrough, I want to make sure I see everything and I read everything. Okay, so right here we. Somebody we've... didn't have time to put his blues on. Okay, that was probably Brad's. I wonder if that was Brad's. I don't remember. Okay, we've got a note here. Email outbox. Sender Lucien. Subject disposal complete. September 26 at 2:35 a.m. Department in chaos after spread of infection. Multiple citizens taking refuge here are infected. All files related to you successfully uh, disposed of, awaiting further orders. Communications intercepted. This is on the following day, September 27. Communications intercepted from S Hospital or HOSP. I don't know. On STARS, a private communications line. Presumed to be evac request from B. Possible he will flee the hospital and come here. Request UBCS dispatch. I will evacuate with their assistance. Hmm. So the, the same day, later on throughout the uh, afternoon or nighttime, I believe. Requested evac has not yet arrived. This position is becoming un, uh, unattainable. I remained here with the, con uh, with the condition my safety would be guaranteed. If I am left here to die, I will distribute proof of collision and corruption between you and RC's civic leaders. You have one hour to deliver a response. And this is Brad. Monday, October 27, 1997. I am written exam. Join our team. Sorry, poster boy. Sorry, Brad. Looks like you uh, you died now. And uh, unfortunately for you, you died in a really shady way, man. But what you did back there, not cool, man. 
You tricked that man into thinking you were still human. And then you took the opportunity upon yourself and you bit him in the gut. And now he's bleeding to death and we know what happens to him. He dies and of course Leon ends up killing him when he turns into a zombie. But it's okay. It's okay. We're really about to really fucking head into the police department. I can't believe this shit. Okay. Nothing here. Okay, I think that's clear. Let's go inside, boys. There we go. Where'd that cop go? Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. Oh, okay. If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Okay, custody. mister. I thought this was a rescue. Exactly. Carlos, take a look at this. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. <laughs> right. Of course. Good to know. Crooked as ever. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. Oh, that's cool. We don't actually have to remember this is the actual keep out. That's the actual door where... Yeah, I'm glad we don't have to uh, worry about any of this. So far, there's electricity here. There's uh, ways to open certain doors, which is a good thing. This right here, we can't. Here's open. a weird fucking door. Leave it. We're here for <laughs> Yeah, that's all for Leon. Okay, so don't worry about that, Carlos. I'm gonna check these uh little hallways up here. Usually, there's there's either herbs or sprays or maybe handgun ammo or soul rifle ammo. I don't know. I'm just thinking, see, hang on, ammo. I'm just thinking to myself right now. We're here right before Leon arrives, obviously. Because when he arrives, the, the cops already bit. But we're pretty much technically in the timeline where Mr. X is already, he's, he's a thing. Imagine having to run away from Nemesis and him at the same time. I think Nemesis is obviously a lot scarier, but just imagine that. That's crazy. Okay, that's another one of those doors. So there's really nothing up here. Just some handgun ammo. And uh, now that we've got that handgun ammo, we're just going to head back down. Let's just head to where we got to go, boys. Let's not uh, take up too much time here. Let me see if I have any, any unnecessary items. Combine this. Put that there. All right. Okay, nothing here. What do we got here? A letter, ID, security protocols. Each member of the force has been issued an ID card. From now on, the same ID card will be required to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care of using it. If your card goes missing, report lost immediately. So probably we can use this card to open these saves. Of course we can. Why wouldn't be? Able to? Why wouldn't we be able to? Got some assault rifle ammo. I'm definitely gonna need that. There we go. <laughs> That's how those cops died there. What the hell was that thing? Yeah, that's actually that thing with a really big fucking tongue that I really don't like. I'd rather face the nemesis. Oh, look at him. Oh, dear God. Poor dude. I'm sorry, bro. You know, I'd rather face nemesis than, than, this, than this critter that's about to pop out at us. So just letting you guys know before we die or worse, jump scared. Jump scares are worse than death. Stick around. Oh hi, we got a zombie friend here. here I'm about, to, I'm about to put some lead in your ass. Better not look at me with that face. Now, that's right. Sit down, chump. Lay down. Stand up. Oh hi, oh fuck. Don't need to. Oh, 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 he's got a different move than Joe. I want to go dodge and. Oh hi. Right, chump. Fuck out of here. My name is Carlos, and I'm an expert with the handgun. Flash grenade. That'll help. Oh, yeah, that'll help. Let's see. Make sure there's nothing here. Okay, by the way, can we go more that way? Is there anything here? No, nothing here. Okay, so this is clear. I'm just gonna head back this way. We go nice and easy. T, Locker room. You copy? 
There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Oh. Something nasty. All right. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. C could that be a code to one of the locks? CAD or CAP. I'm going to keep that in mind. CAP, CAD. All right. CAD or CAP. Oh, hi. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Oh, all right. Y'all motherfuckers want some lead? Come here. I'm about to give you this shit. Oh, oh, that's a big fella. Oh, he's coming in for some heat. Don't fuck with Carlos, bro. I've seen this guy before. I've seen that dude. I, I see that Asian zombie everywhere. He must be a uh, part of like triplets or some shit because a boy does not go unnoticed. Oh, there's more there. Okay, hold on. Oh, wait, he's standing up. How cute. Look at him. How about you sit back down, big fella? <laughs> not today, Shanae. Oh, oh, fuck. You lost your hat there, buddy. We're good. I think we're clear. Perfect. All right, we're familiar with these hallways. We're very familiar with these hallways. Oh, we've got another herb. Let's see what we got here. Nice. All right, we just need to find a red herb and we're good. Oh my fucking lord. That guy came out of nowhere. Okay. Yeah, sit down. Right, is there anything back here that we can investigate? I don't think so. Oh, there's one of those uh, one of those chests. How about in here? God, we need a freaking key to go in there. Okay, let's go back in here. Open this up. Use the key card. Perfect. Excellent. Ooh, scope assault rifle. Nice. Custom part for the seat. All right, never mind. I didn't even damn read that shit. Oh, look at this little cute zombie there. Isn't he cute? <laughs> you really trying to get up, my boy? I don't think so. Not today. So handgun ammo. Oh, dude. I remember there was a freaking code for that. Oh, we're probably going to have to go look for it. Come back down and open that up. Let's see. I know usually in these cubicles we got stuff. So September 20th, arrest reports. Rodney Gray, occupation unemployed, former electrician. Charges, unlawful uh, creation and and or possession of explosives narrative suspect was behaving uh suspiciously at 1442 box street on september 18th of 1998 suspects person was searched producing a small explosive and a time detonator from his inside pocket leading to an arrest on the charges listed above a search of suspects home found more than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion suspect was extremely agitated and not of sound mind suspect uh, spoke uh, feverishly when questioning began and at one point questioning had to have been halted due to the sudden about a shrieking from suspect once questioning was resumed the suspect made the following statements i do it for me i didn't do it for me i did it for you why doesn't anyone understand the corpse is attacked from the shadows a storm's coming but the umbrella is no good you gotta blow it up or you'll be more than just wet you gotta get more bombs he's pretty much just warning us about the whole craziness with this outbreak they're coming soon gotta hurry burn them burn the corpses burn them good during questioning the suspect began to shake violently because resuming uh before resuming a shrieking fit questioning was ended and a sedative administered notes due to the suspect's unstable psychi psychiatric condition uh the testimony changed from moment to moment suspects delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the results of a doctor's investigation into suspect condition. The explosives collected from suspect's person and residents appear to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, a battery was removed from the bed, uh, from the detonation device. Upon its admission into evidence, the battery was secured and it's in the safety deposit room. Okay, so we'll probably come across that once we start going upstairs or whatnot. All right, nice. Combined with this, perfect. Handgun ammo. Don't mind if I do. Okay, is that door closed? Yep, that's the door that actually leads to where we came from. The main hall. Nothing else in here. How about these lockers? Ooh. Soul rifle ammo. Very nice. Okay, 
Alright, we're gonna have to head. Oh, hi. Hi, hi, hi. We're in the clear now. Oh, fuck. Okay, here we go. This is a safe house, right? I think this is a safe house. Yes, it is. Perfect. Excellent. Alright, get some more soul rifle ammo. Another herb. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna put some of the stuff. Uh, actually, I can combine this with the assault rifle. I don't know why, but I didn't do that before. Must have forgot to slip my mind. All right, so internal memo. September 22nd of 1998. Uh, officer supply internal relo uh, relocation notice. He resistant three number combination safe. Move from star's office, second floor to the west office, first floor. The combo is left nine, 15, seven. So. 9157 9, yeah, I'm gonna remember that Well if cameras kill those things I'd be set <laughs> A 9157 I'm actually gonna put this red herb on the case here 9157 9157 9157 9157 I'm gonna go over here Oh hi dude you're still alive Come on bro 915. Oh! Okay, he did. 9157, 9157, 9157. Back in here we go. Please do not crawl at me. So, this is what was moved. So, 9157. Please be something good. hip pouch dude holy crap hell yeah this is literally like these are like so important it's it's not even funny how important they are anyways we got a hip pouch now we are good to go kind of fucked up shooting cops yes it is indeed very fucked up but hey man a cop must do what a cop's got to do the star's office is up ahead copy that Okay, so wasn't there like a locker here or something? Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it blocked? I don't know, Carlos. Oh, see, that's the, deton the detonator. Oh, nice. Okay, I'll put it here. Okay. Guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. Awesome. Oh, here we go. So CAD, right? This is the, the, the note that was on the bulletin or on the, the little board downstairs, the, the, the message. CAD or CAP? Yep, CAP. Cap. Ah, what is that? Another flash grenade. <laughs> Very nice. Is there a... Oh, there's a note here. Note to a friend, Hector. If you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear that any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you were out on a patrol, I focused on finding a way to get out, uh, to get out to the other side. I realized the explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, which is the one we found in the, in the showers just now. But we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during the, uh, the intake last week. We need to get that battery if we're going to knock this wall down. So I headed upstairs to find you since. I know you have safety deposit room key so we got to go upstairs to find the key to then head down to the first floor as soon as i left the shower room i was attacked one of uh, one of them bit me i washed the wound as best as i could but i feel worse and worse i hope i don't need to spell out why you must not open that locker please don't worry about me just go get yourself out here uh get yourself out of here as soon as as fast as you can your buddy wes p.s don't worry about the 600 dollars i lent you think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move good luck buddy um i don't think you can collect that money uh you already did Better not. No, let's do it. No, oh, okay. Can't open up that locker. I know we open it up with Leon. And a zombie comes out of there. That zombie's gonna wake up when I come back down. I just know it. This game is predictable. Oh, here's the key. Nice. Thankfully, we've got enough storage space. Um. Oh, what was the code for this one? DC DCM Oh <laughs> Wow I actually remember from <laughs> Resident Evil 2 Re Resident Evil 2 That's crazy I am a genius 
All right, guys. Let's go back down. Uh-oh. Something's happening. There's, like, loading in the game. Oh, God. I freaking knew it, dude. Stay down, punk. Stay down. I will knife your ass. Dude. Really? What the hell, man? Bro! <laughs> what the freaking crap? How many bullets do you take, zombie? Do you not understand? I am Carlos. I am the that de uh, the demolitioner, the terminator. All up in your anus. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I am delusional to the point where I don't even believe my own words. I'm fucked. Oh, shit. There's that. You want to fuck with me? You fuck with me. You fucking with the best. Okay, hold on. Scarface reference. Hey. Here he goes. Dude, do you not understand? I don't want to lick your ass. Get up off me, bro. Go get a girl for some shit. Yeah, he's having a seizure. Good. Those are like mini nemesis, you know? Like miniature versions of the nemesis. Or or so I think. Or I don't know. Maybe not. They just look alike, bro. It's gonna be some zombie here. I know it. Oh. Look, it's the Asian dude again. Hold you. Sit back down, punk. What do you want to play? To play games with you? Save measures. Make sure you're dead. What? How are you still alive? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, so we've got uh, 104, 106, and 109. 104, 106, and 109. Anything else on this side? All right, let's see if we can open this up. So, 104. Right. Uh, no, sorry. 106. 10. Ah, uh, we don't have. We don't have the little card, uh, the little number pad for nine. Whatever. This is the battery. Nice. Now we can put the battery on the detonator, and bada beam, bada boom. I know. That's right, Carlos. It's yours now, baby. Let's go. I don't know where the uh huh. oh that's an oh shit that's a nerve right there i hear a bobblehead hi perfect let's see dcm third floor locker <laughs> i'm already one step ahead of the game bro okay one step ahead of the game Oh, hi! What the freaking crap? Second floor. Yep, it was here. That's dudish. Carlos, I've hit a dead end at the terminal here. Gotta head your way. Copy that. Okay, let's detonate this shit. Oh, hi. Wait, wait a minute. That's, that's not nice. That is not nice. Okay, now I'm missing all my... Oh, God, I'm nervous. Oh, what the... What? What the, what the hell is this? Oh, that steam in the back. Oh, my God. Hello? Gotta be shitting me right now. One at a time, take a number. This is fucking ridiculous. This is what is this shit? One at a time, take a number. Now for that, you're all gonna fucking die. Because this is Carlito's way. I 
subscribe punk all right that was ruthless that was uh there was no need for all that uh capcom like really the, the fact that you made me go through that nonsense that that should be illegal that there was no need for that first aid spray of course <laughs> it's like the game knows here have a first aid spray you're gonna need it buddy bucko old pal like they were all trapped in here waiting to just eat me this is I fucking hate you. I hope you rot in hell. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Yep. Oh. Jesus Christ, bro. Oh! Dude! What is up with these zombies today? They just don't quit! Is there anything else back here? Ooh, look at this. Assault rifle ammo. Oh, there's another zombie. But you know what? I'm not even gonna waste my time with you, bro. Honestly. Alright, you know what? I'll just shoot you. Fuck it. It's fine. Oh, we got a cutscene. Nice. Dr. Bard. This is the guy we're looking for. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry. We're going to get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're going to know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out. Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. Yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. All right, well. This will take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Right, let's see. I don't know. Personally, I don't like that guy. My partner. I don't like him too much. He's, he's got a little bit of a slick mouth. Like, damn it, I'm your partner, man. You should be agreeing with me right now. All right, let's just search this office real quick. Get the essentials that we need and just get the hell up out of here. Let's just get out of here. Out of here we go. Out of here we go. Okay, so I'm going to report from uh, on the mansion incident. The bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Star's Bravo team was dispatched to the Arclay Mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders and went unexpectedly radio sightings. On July 24th, the day later, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events at the nearby mansion. The incident... Uh, culminated in the destruction of the mansion. Casualties were numerous. The only the only survivors were five members of STARS. The cause of the incident was uh, the illegal bioweapon experiments being carried out in a secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion. The T-virus being used in the experiment escaped the facility and is presumed to be the root cause of all, th all that occurred. However, all evidence was destroyed along with the mansion, so further investigation has proven to be extremely uh, difficult. Is that Jill in the front row? Oh shit, that is Joe right there, the third, uh, fourth one to the right, on the front front row. <laughs> That's right, Carlos. Joe's not just any 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 ordinary sexy lady. She's a badass bitch. You better respect her, man. She'll kick your ass. Oh, another first aid spray. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. And what do we got here? Okay. Yeah, I've got enough space to. Oh, actually, I can put this over here. I got no more use for this. No more use for this. Combine. Put this here. 
Um, also, reloaded my hand. Oh, reloaded my handgun. Perfect. Now we'll put this here. And put this here. All right, nice. We're looking pretty good. Anything else? I think we've pretty much cleared everything out. Is yes, there nothing here? Awesome. Nothing else. Okay. Good. Yeah. What's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill. Jill, what happened? Jill, come in. T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bart. Damn. Holy crap. Several minutes earlier, subway tunnels. Oh, snap. Back with Jill again. <laughs> underground, as always. This lady lives underground. Now, for a fact, I know Nikolai is alive, and he's an asshole. He's probably going to be one of the main antagonists towards the end of the story. I have a feeling about that. I don't like that man. At all. All right, find a way above ground. Is there anything here? Nope. Am I the only one who made it? All right, Joe, baby, let's go. Man, that guy, Victor, man, he sacrificed his life. That's the real MVP right here. If it wasn't for him, we'd all be dead right now. We have a safe house. Great. Great success. Carlos, come in. Carlos? Damn it. I guess I'm out of range. All right, nice. We got another first aid. We've got a note from the UBCS. New weaponry notice. Good news, limp dicks. <laughs> I've got some new weapons for you that's guaranteed to put a brass back in your sacks. They're called mini, uh, mine rounds. Uh, these babies were developed by the Umbrella's military R&D, and they will light your fires even hotter than the lover you're, you left back at home. You're tough to find. Uh, they're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. All right, let's take a look at the specs. So mine rounds are designed for standard issue, uh, issue grenade launchers. Do not, uh, don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at walls or the ground, and they'll stay right there where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get within range. So basically, just toss them in an enemy's path, and you've got yourself a landmine. And there's no such thing as unfair when you're taking on the giant freak. So get out there and fight dirty. Mine rounds. Excellent. I think there was more right here. Okay. Hold on. Do we have anything that's not needed? We have a first aid spray. No, I'm going to take the grenade just in case. All right, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and get into some mine rounds. I have a feeling some shit's about to go down. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. What the freaking crap? All right, I'm not going to use the mine rounds just yet. Waste my rounds of mines or, or mine. Oh, that guy's dead. There's nothing here. Okay. Nothing here. Interesting. All right. Good. Well, coast is clear. Let's get the hell out of here. This was not clear. Fuck off. See the Chinese guy again. Or Japanese, the, the Asian. Come on, bro. I clearly dodged that. Stop the bullshit, man. Don't give me these fucking lies. Is there anything else here that I can get? You know what, bro? Fuck out of here. Take that. Oh God. still alive. <laughs> of course he's alive. Are you surprised? You know what he said? Are you not entertained? He's coming for us, guys. He's definitely coming for us, and he's gonna put a pounding on our ass. 
He's gonna kill us. He's here to kill us. Oh, nice. We got, we got a nice little crate here. Let me pop this open. Oh, look at this. Very nice. Little cute thing. Okay. That was actually really well hidden. There. But uh, not well enough because I am Jill the Inspector. Nothing gets past me. Let's go back upstairs. It's like he knows where to go, right? It's like, look, it's like he, he knows there's water there. So he's like, fuck it. Bitch can't even swim. <laughs> I don't know, man. This doesn't Carlos, look good. Carlos, respond. Yeah, what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, shit. Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? Oh, Get what back. the fucking crap? Shoot, what happened? Shoot, oh! Oh, this thing just mutated! Like a second floor, like Super Saiyan 2 or some shit. Wow, dude. What the freaking crap is this? Don't tell me I've got to fight this man. Oh god, dude. Come on! Defeat the creature. You really want me to defeat this creature right now? Really? Wait, I got a grenade for his ass. Hold on, I've got... Yep. I'm going to shortcut to... Uh... Here, dumbass. Take that grenade. <laughs> you like that? Okay, hold on. All right, baby, let's go. Nice. Shit, he's coming. That, that didn't even hit him. Oh my god. Come on, switch the rounds, Joe. There's gotta be uh, some. There's gotta be some sort of ammo or something around here. Oh my God, he's right on me, dude. Here we go. Okay, he's mad. He's mad. Ah! Holy shit. Oh, come on. <laughs> Dude, leave me alone. Are you kidding me? Oh, I need more ammo. I'm a little earned. I'm a little injured. Just gotta be a green herb around here. Oh, there he goes again. Gotta find a way to stop it. Yes. Where is he? <laughs> Not so bad now, huh, punk? Look at you! Look at you! Yes! Okay, hold on. We've gotta find I I gotta find somewhere else. This 
guy's gonna fucking destroy me if I don't find more. Ah, uh, unfortunately, I can't. You know what? stop it in its tracks. More ammo right here. Okay, hold on. Um. Hold on, hold on. I gotta mix. I gotta mix this with this. I gotta take this. Put this right here. Nice. Reload my weapon so when he comes back down, he's done. Oh god. More mine rounds right here. Oh my god, what the fuck are you doing? Flame rounds, flame rounds. Here you go, punk. That's right, you want that? Like that? Holy cow. This thing is massive, bro. Okay, where'd he go? It's coming. It's coming. I'm gonna kill you. Oh yes, I am. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you, all right. Reload my shotgun. Reload my pistol. And swap over to. Oh, I don't have any more rounds of flame. Back around. They're right there. I need to stop it in its tracks. There we go. Perfect. Oh shit! Right? Let's do this. You did it. Nice. Stop it! <laughs> stop it, damn it, it. I think it's crazy, bro. It's like completely mutated. Insane, Carlos, bro. you still there? Come on, you gotta crap out on me now? <laughs> For real, Carlos. Jill needs you right now, pal. You know, after this is all over, you guys can go have a nice little you know, not the time. Uh, let's see. Uh, making sure there's no, like, extra, you know, I don't know, ammo or something left behind or whatever. You see? You see? You see, man? That was very useful. All right, well, Nemesis, it was nice playing with you, but uh, I, I just got to go, buddy. Ah, shit. I don't like this. Oh. This thing does not freaking die. What a badass. Dude. Oh, that can't be good. Interesting. You've done me a big thing. Miss. Dude, I hate this guy, man. I fucking hate him, bro. Roughly a half a day later, she would have choked by now. Jill. Or maybe if she was in that position, maybe not. Hey, answer me. God damn it. Oh, dude, she's freaking Tyrell, infected. Tyrell, you copy? What's going on? Jill's been infected. I... I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Bard can save her. All right, I'll meet you there. You hang in there, super cop. I got you. Wow. 
Holy cow. Oh god, another building. This is gonna be terrible. a perfect spot to end the episode what an episode it's been thank you for watching if you are enjoying the re3 remake let's play here on the channel give it a thumbs up it helps out a lot and i'll catch you on the next one